Hi guys, Light here and in today's video, we're going to check out iOS 14.2 Beta 4 on the iPhone 11. So, the change actually right here is inside the settings application. So if we open the settings app, and if we scroll down to wallpaper settings, choose a new wallpaper, go to still images. If we scroll down, you will see here a new set of wallpapers available for the iPhone 11. The nice thing about these wallpapers is that they're the same ones that you get on the Mac. That means these wallpapers will adapt depending on the appearance that you have set on your device, giving you both a day view and a night view of that wallpaper. So with that being said, let's check out the night view of this wallpaper in dark mode. And as you can see, here we have the wallpaper on dark mode showing us a nice night view with the stars right here on the top. Alright, going back again. Here we have the day view. Moving on to the next wallpaper, here we have a tree. And here we have it on dark mode showing us the night view. And you could also see here the stars again. And here we have some rock formations. And here is how it looks like on daytime. And the next one right here. And we also get illustrated wallpapers such as this. So let's check out the first one. So we got this nice view. Whoops. Actually switch from night shift. Here we go on dark mode. I'm checking out the last one which is a shoreline. And here we have the day view. So those are the new wallpapers in iOS 14.2. Which I think is nice if you're someone like me who has their appearance to change automatically according to the time of the day. Also, checking back on dynamic and live wallpapers. On dynamic, we don't get any new wallpapers. And same goes for live. There aren't any new wallpapers. Also, running a performance test on the iPhone 11, we do get a score of 1,332 for single core and 3,225 for multi-core. We're comparing that to the previous beta, beta 3, we only got the score of 1,335 for single core and 3,035 for multi-core. Also, running another test using Antutu Benchmark, we do get a score of 492,501 for the iPhone 11, which previously was just 465,237 for the iPhone 11. Also, unfortunately, there is a known bug on this beta that you cannot play or even reply to intercom messages, but hopefully we'll get that fixed in the future update. And also, speaking of update, looks like we're already in the A phase of the builds, so that means we're only a couple of builds away to get the new and amazing features of iOS 14.2 available on the iPhone 11. So those are the upcoming changes for the iPhone 11. As always guys, thank you for watching and please subscribe for more.